Hello everybody and welcome to E-Rev TV once again where right now we're going to be covering Cal Main and the two participants will be Frag Dominant going up against Powerhouse both teams 2 and 0. Oh. I'm your hostess with the mostest. My name is Anger and uh, co-casting with me tonight will be uh, Eric Wansom but he's not in right now but he should be in, in a little bit so I will be going solo for the first uh, portions of this cast. Doing video tonight will be my man Mayday. And uh, you can get your shout outs over to me at pound e dash rev on the Game Surge Network. And you can get those to me right now. So Cal M here on uh, this great map that seems like we've been on for the past, what, week or so, give or take. Um, this is going to be an interesting match, and uh, it's good to see some good uh, Cal M caliber type teams here on this map. Once again, we took a look at uh, the two matches prior. We saw some Cal Open action there, and uh, it's going to be a little bit different here between these two teams. Obviously, the uh, the players are a little bit better, the strats, and uh, just the overall gameplay will be a, a lot better here. So it's going to be a lot easier on the eyes. So right now, uh, as I'm looking here at Powerhouse Gaming, we've casted this team a lot here from Erev and uh, you know they picked up Apostle oh a while back now and he's just fit in just fine here uh, with PHG so uh, the way it looks right now for uh, Op Foresight which will be PHG it will be my man Apostle Insight Grim Dollar Bill now I'm not sure if they're gonna bring in Insight or if they're gonna bring in a new guy and I couldn't if it was Big Dog and I'm not sure uh, he was loaded up and in so I'm not sure how that's gonna play out oh it looks like they're bringing in Insight so it's gonna be Apostle Insight, Grim, and Dollar Bill, and Improv for Powerhouse. While for Frag Dominant, we're going to have A Rock, Spinks, uh, The Man, SSR, and they have an individual named Asian Sensation. <laughs> Sounds like a stripper from Tokyo, but nevertheless, um, he, he, I guess he's from Frag D, so we're just waiting on that. Uh, again, this, uh, this is going to be Cal M action here. So we hope you enjoy this. Now, just to let you know, we have a media partner, and the name is LeetTube. You can head on over to www.leetube.com there and uh, check out that site there. They're pretty much just a YouTube of gaming. You can get your videos up there, your frag videos. Uh, no porn videos, please. Uh, they might even host that, but uh, you have to be over 21 or 18 to watch that. So some of you may not be able to see some of the scenes that I may put out if I do put it on LeetTube. But more majority of the time, it's going to be just fragging videos. And it uh, looks like they're waiting for myself and Mayday to ready up there. And looks like I have. And it was just wait for Mayday. So make sure you head on over to www.leet. That's with the ND with the T. And begin tube with the T. T-U-B-E dot com. And uh, check that site out. So uh, right now we're going to get things underway here. I'm going to take a look at, oh, okay, it looks like Ace's Sensation is going to be Buns uh, for Frag D, so we got to the uh, the uh, solving of that mystery there. So right now, uh, we have Frag D coming out, and uh, they're going to be taking the Marine side, and they're going to be the uh, defensive side, while PHG is going to be the Op 4 side, and they will be the aggressor here, trying to get that bomb down. And it looks like PHG is pushing really heavy towards the A side. We have Insight and Dollar Bill for Powerhouse here. Uh, kind of in carpool area while Grim is going to be scoping it up along with Improv there uh, backing him up with some M4 as I'm circling around we have Speaks just hanging out we have the first kill here Bun's taking out Apostle with a nice MP5 shot there in the uh, champagne room so we have Speaks uh, holding off in the spawn site for uh, for Frag D we have uh, Grim holding off and he's pushing actually a little forward here as smoke been deployed around the uh, bomb site area Dollar Bill taking out SSR A Rock taking out Improv there with an M4 so right now we we have Grim and Dollar Bill for Powerhouse here. They got about a little bit shade over a minute here uh, to get this bomb down. We have four members of Frag D. We have A Rock, Buns, Spinks, and the man uh, TM for Frag D. So uh, it's going to be interesting. Oh, Grim get taken out by Buns. Uh, Buns over here on the flanking uh, motion here. Frag D, Spinks taking out Dollar Bill there. And uh, Frag D will take an early 1 to 0 lead. Just like always. Ways we will have war room coverage, and we're going to head head on over there after probably the third round. So uh, stay tuned for that, and uh, hope you guys are enjoying this cast as we just head on over to Cal Main here on Erev TV. I'm going to take a look here at Powerhouse Gaming here off the start, and it looks like 
Again, we have Dollar Bill and Insight heading over to Carpool while Grimm's in the Champagne Room. Apostle on the uh, Spiral Stairs uh, for the Op 4 side. So um, right now, as I'm flicking around over here to the uh, Frag D side, looks like we have uh, Spinks at the... Uh the balcony here on the uh, cafe side here at at uh, a site we also have looks like um, buns holding off in the uh, B house we're gonna take a look at buns here as he's gonna be uh, taking on two members of PHG a rock taking out apostle there so that is a good thing frag D needs to do is really put apostle uh, down and quick here because he is gonna make a difference that guy is insane with the mp5 and with this type of map here with the close uh, combat here uh, he has a, a great chance to uh, display those talents. And, oh, Improv! Taking out Buns there. Nice shot. And uh, we have Improv in the uh, mid area. We're going to take a look at Improv as he's sneaking, sneaky here. Uh, we have Grim and Improv here. Oh, Improv taking out SSR. So we have a two on two. The man and A-Rock. A-Rock just got wiped out by Grim there. Nice shot with the scope. So right now we have Grim and Improv here. Uh, going up against uh, the man, so we're gonna see how much TM can hold off to his name here. The man here for Frag D. Uh, he's taking some shots on Grim here. Uh, they have PHG has to get this bomb down in about 26 seconds here, so they have a little bit of time in their favor here. Uh, looks like the man is flanking around, trying to head over to the mid area while Grim is kind of stalking him. But actually, Grim is gonna take this bomb and he's gonna try to place it in the B site. And he does that, so the man right now has a shade over 55 seconds to get this done. All right, it looks like we have my man Eric Wantsum in here. Wantsum, you here, buddy? Hey, what's going on? Sorry I'm late. Uh, no, no problem, bro. I know you were getting your grub on there. Uh, I guess your your gut was a little bit more important than the cast. No, I'm just kidding, buddy. <laughs> the man I'm taking out improv right there. Now. <laughs> taking out improv there with the AK so right now it's gonna be 1v1 the man going up against Grim so this is gonna be a nice matchup here as uh, Grim got the uh, bomb down and Grim takes out the man there with the MP5 and ties everything up one to one here so right now early off here we have SSR for frag D uh, going three and two a rock going two and one and for the op four side which will be powerhouse we have Grim going two and one and dollar bill going two and two Right now, I'm going to take a look at Powerhouse here on the uh, defensive stand and we're see how they uh, place their uh, de defensive strat here. We have Buns in mid-area heading off to market. We have TM taking out Apostle there with a nice nade placement. And uh, we have A-Rock really pushing deep into B side here for Frag D. Speaks and SN SSR get a KO both here, taking out uh, Insight and Improv. So right now, we have Dollar Bill and Grim uh, going up its five members of frag d so it's gonna be very interesting here see what Grim and dollar bill can pull off here uh... Grimm again scoping for her powerhouse in the uh... carpool area just really being uh... really hesitant right now and uh, as i'm just filtering around here we have spinks holding off the a cafe and dollar bill actually in the a site now making his way back into carpool and buns holding off the uh... spiral area and he might do a flank move here and uh, he's really taking his time and we have the man holding off a balcony so that is your placement from all the members here that are alive again we have Grim and Dollar Bill uh, the only two members for powerhouse right now while we have uh, five members again from Frag D and Grim taking out the buns there so just uh, dropping buns there like a bad habit with the scope so Grim going up against uh, all by himself here as SSR is trying to sneak around the carpool area possibly to take him out but he doesn't a Rock does that with the MP5 there and right now two to one in the favor of Frag D. Now I was talking to Frag D earlier in the week and uh, we're gonna take a listen into their vent. I'm gonna tell you right now it may be a little colorful for my taste but they are some funny ass individuals so let's go to Frag D now. I hit one. Where are you, Rob? I'm up on the platform, A platform. I think I crawled. I, I'm pretty sure that thought one did. They're at the wall. I'm not peeking it, I'm peeking the wall. A cut, A cut! One in front of you, Buns. One little A cut. Um, B house, B house, B house. 
Wow, last two. Once Junkyard, once A platform. That was down, Flower Stairs. I'm gonna hide in mid. Very good spot. Smoke B. Planning B, run. Dead, nice, nice. Good job, Charlie. Good round, guys. Listen, this round, I'm gonna throw the short nade. I want someone to throw a deep nade. Because they're just waiting for my okay, short Okay, I will, I will. I'll throw, I'll throw it. Rob, you got it? Okay. Yep, I got it. Alright, back to live action and frack. Dominant right now with an early three to one lead, and Insight had that two v one possible clutch situation there, but could get it done. Uh, got stunned there, and that was pretty much it. Uh, Watson is so far a very entertaining match thus far uh, compared to uh, the other matches that we had. Uh, again, an even somewhat evenly match here off the beginning, and uh, as we take a look at Powerhouse Watson, uh, what do we have over there for them? Well, uh, you know, like I said earlier, this is very defensive-sided map, so things are sort of going as planned here for uh, Fragdom. And it uh, looks like uh, PHU is going to go ahead and make a full-on B-Rush. They have Apostle playing in the middle right now. Doesn't see anybody uh, headed over from A. Improv, Grim, and Insight are all into the B-Bomb site right now, uh, moving past the Champagne Room and B-Alley. They're taking a peek around the corner, looking for some uh, Fragdominant players here. I actually don't see any peeking the corner. It looks like they're uh, hanging out in spawn. The next closest one I see is actually... Uh, Tim, I believe. Uh, Apostle's going to be coming up the mid towards him, right around the wall from him. Let's see what happens here. And he's, uh, Tim's going to get the kill on Apostle. Improv's going to go down to Fragdom. So Fragdom is up 5-3 to three right now. Uh, PHG Grim and Insight working into the B-bomb side as well. Uh, <clears throat> they're playing real slow right now. They're much more relaxed than a lot of teams I've seen play this map, Anger. There's not as much smoke and rushing going on here, and they're really relying on the... Uh, you know, just out shooting their opponent, not so much on the strategy, which is is disappointing in my my opinion. But it's still going to be a great match. Yeah, right now we have four members of Frag D and Insight and Grim. Seem like they're always the last two to to uh, survive this onslaught so far from Frag D. And uh, we're going to see. It looks like Grim right now is hanging out uh, at the uh, Champagne Alley. He's making his way back into the Champagne Room. Probably wants another. Uh, lap dance but no actually he's leaving that area <laughs> we have speaks right now along with uh, TM the man uh, uh, holding off the uh, B site right now and Buns takes out inside and Buns with a double kill there taking out Grim and cleans that up and right wow. now Frag D doing an excellent excellent job uh, just holding off PHG here so right now uh, let's go to powerhouses gaming's war room because I'm very interested to hear uh, what they're gonna do here as they might have to change up their strats here I'm rushing A quickly. Mid. Oh my god. I got A ledge. One A stair is down. Take it, take it. I'm nading top A. He's up there. Watch my nade, it may bounce off. Yo, he's ledge, he's ledge, they're ledge, they're ledge. Push him. Dude, dude, he's sitting back in the top A, top A, top, top A. a. Rob, we have A, man. Alright, you're in fuck okay, it. One is top That's A, good. that door. Fake ass. This guy's top A. I'll go to B. Last guy's top A, I'll plant B in B. two seconds. Alright, I'm watching the cross. Alright, it's down. On temple side. There you go. Nice job. Nice. I called Doug just in case All someone... Right, PhD needed that round there. 4-2 to two right now as they try to inch a little bit closer here, Wansom. And uh, thus far, again, a very, very entertaining match. And uh, let's see. They changed things up just slightly a little there. And uh, actually, it came out on top. Oh, absolutely. They uh, did a much better job playing a little more reserved there around the B-bomb side as well as A. Uh, staying clear of the nades. 
Uh, looks like they're going to try and do the same uh, sort of approach here of Dollaville and Insight moving towards the A balcony right now. A lot of smoke going up. Uh, don't see anybody from Frag Dominant just yet. Uh, some more smoke going up. Oh, it looks like Frag Dominant is going to move through uh, the middle right now. Uh, PHE is still moving into the A bomb site. Sphinx taking down Improv with an AK-47 there from across the A building. Uh, Frag, Frag Dominant got there just in time to sort of slow down the rush. Dollar Bill is pinned down on the stairs right now. Uh, going prone there, uh, looking towards the middle, going to throw a smoke. Uh, he's actually going to fake plant here, um, move towards the A building. So I'm going to cycle through and look through the middle here, see if we've got some firefights going on. Looks like we have Grim moving up towards uh, the middle connector there, towards the spawn, and uh, we have Apostle already up there on the balcony. So PSG has pretty much uh, uh, <coughs> fragged on the corner right now, and they're going to exchange two kills there. Grim with a great uh, nade kill, Dollar Bill getting a headshot there. And uh, Fragdom is down now, uh, three to, up, I'm sorry, three to two now. Dollar Bill and Grim again, the only two left for uh, PHG right now. And if they could pull this clutch out, Anger, they could really slow the momentum down here and uh, sort of keep uh, things in their favor going into the half here. It's still early, but uh, this will be a big round for them. Yeah, Buns, Buns shoots people with guns. That's from KFC, and he's pretty much summing it all up because right now Buns is just going wild on power. Powerhouse right now. He's doing a nice job cleaning up the little messes that uh, Powerhouse is giving him. And uh, again, he's just really a one-man machine so far, and just really uh, taking it to Powerhouse uh, in the early uh, portions of this match. Right now, we're going to take a look at Buns as he's making his way towards the market area. Him and Spinks are the uh, two members alive going up against Grim and Dollar Bill uh, from PHG. And actually, Speaks gets taken out there, or excuse me, yeah, and uh, we have Buns all by himself. So it's going to be interesting to see if Buns can hold off to his namesake here that was been brought upon from KFC, uh, live from IRC. And, oh, oh Grim sir. takes out Buns there, and, no, oh, Powerhouse comes back 4-3, to three, wants him. Uh, he likes him some crispy chicken anger, ate him up. So I'm going to take a look here at uh, PHG from the start, see if they uh, adjust any more than they already have. Uh, pretty evenly matched teams right now. I'm excited we're getting to cast this match. I think it's going to go down to the wire. Uh, let's take a look at PHG right now. They're doing a 3-2 split. Looks like uh, Dollar Bill and Insight are going to head towards A. they got some pre-firing going down at the middle buildings right now. Some smoke going up. Uh, three members of PHB or PHG are now going to move towards the B bomb site relatively slow. It looks like Fragment Dominant has already set up defensive positions. And uh, everybody's playing real, real slow now outside the champagne room. Looks like we have a firefight going on today. Right now I'm going to cycle through. Bun's taking down Grim, living up to his name there. Dollar Bill hanging out up on top of the uh, balcony here at BPHG. He has three members, and boom goes the dynamite for Dollar Bill. The man goes down, set need. PHG has the A-bomb site. They should be able to get a plan off here, Anger. Yeah, they're really hesitant, though, because smoke has been deployed here, and I'm surprised Insight was actually heading to that area, but now he gives a fake uh, plant. Well, I see why he was doing that. SSR was at eight arches there, and Apostle takes him out. Nice backup there from Apostle, so uh, Insight might have the opportunity here to get this plant down. And again, four members of Powerhouse right now are alive and kicking. We have Buns and A-Rock for Frag D, and right now we have A-Rock flanking around Flower Pot right now. Dollar Bill doesn't see him. Oh, he takes out Dollar Bill there wow. and A Rock is in the uh, looks like balcony A balcony right now near the uh, cafe here. So it's going to be interesting here. 46 seconds to get this uh, diffused here. A Rock and Buns has a, a, a tough task here going up against Insight and Apostle. I'm very surprised right now. Wants him that Apostle is three and seven. This is very unique. I've never seen this from him in any matches until now. I agree. It looks like he's in the firefight for his life right now. He's going to lose to Bonds. Apostle, uh, you know, sort of continues to disappoint here, Anger. I have never seen this. Uh, you know, he's doing a little bit of utility work for his team here, but uh, really Grim and Dollar Bill taking all the work, and Bonds is just dominating everybody with a mean 12-4. and four. And, uh, you know, it's going to be interesting to see, uh, Anger. PHG is coming off a big win, you know, at the first ever Call of Duty Ford LAN up there in Michigan, I believe. Uh, they're seated third going into the Nerve LAN, which E-Rev will be covering. We're better than you, and we know it. We'll be there. You guys can enjoy the show. So it'll be really interesting to see how they do on LAN, if they sort of boot camp and get their act together. And uh, this match will be a, a good test for them uh, as far as how they're going to play against those top teams, Anger. Yeah, it's, and, you know, with... Uh, with Buns right now, and again, and I apologize for this, I'm still learning a lot of the teams thus I've been in it this long, but Frag Dominant, this is my very first time seeing him actually at, in this uh, atmosphere, and who is this mass man Buns, because this guy's, you know, again, I, I can't say enough about Apostle, because this guy's a beast, I've seen him enough, 
to just say that and give him that name because Buns is really uh, holding him off here and not just holding him off but he's holding off PHG in in a hole here really putting him in a bind uh, Grim right now is really carrying his team thus far here and uh, Grim is still alive as we speak so I'm going to try the inside is moving around here to mid area and he's going to head his way towards the spiral Grim gets taken out by the man there at the uh, a uh, arches there so I probably pretty much put Grim in a jinx uh, situation there so we have improv by himself right now uh, he's in carpool area and he's gonna have a tough task here he's going up against four frag D members here bun Spinks, a rock and the man here so uh, this is gonna be a tough oh nice headshot on bun oh, right. another kill there on a rock uh oh can he can he clutch it here? He's going up, going, going up against Sphinx and the man. Can Improv do it here? Let's put the Jeopardy theme song in the background because this is going to be interesting <laughs> to see if he can do this. Oh, oh he, he takes out the man. <laughs> this oh, is what great man. players are made of right here, Anger. He's going to make his way towards the B-bomb site. He is going to have time to get a plan off. I'm um, trying to cycle through here. Looks like Sphinx is far enough away. There is going to be a bomb plant. We'll be on a 60 second clock. Sphinx versus Improv. We're doing it. 1v1 clutch situation. Anger, who's your pick? Well, the way right now that Grant, or excuse me, Improv is on a nice roll right now. Getting the plant down. Getting those three kills. He's holding off. He's putting the pressure to Sphinx. I'm going to go with Improv on this one because right now he's just on the nice roll right now. So we're going to see what Sphinx does as I'm looking. Uh, Improv just holding off at B arches right now. And Sphinx pretty much has enough time. He's just checking out B house right here. He's got about a shade over 30 seconds here to get something going. And again, Improv just holding tight in B arches. Uh, he's being slightly a little impatient. Um, getting some moves down. Now they're going to be going one on one. Oh, he gets taken out by Sphinx with an AK. Takes out Improv and he's got more than enough time uh, to get this defused. Nice job by Sphinx there. And uh, taking out the improv there. <laughs> improv was beasting it up and he almost had that clutch uh, uh, cleanup mess there on IO5. So 6 to 3 right now. Frag D gets a nice lead thus far. So right now we're going to head on over to uh, Frag Dominant's uh, war room uh, for their next round here. Let's, let's head over there right now. Tell this nigger that it's Sphinx and not Sphinx. Makes him sound like a You shut up. You leave him alone. I didn't hear nothing A. Not playing B cut. Rob, let me know when you're pushing up, dude. They smoked it like they're going there. Mid market. Let me know when you push up. Mid market. Coming A cut. Going A. There's smoke A. Another one B. Another one B. B house. Coming B cut. I got it. No, no, no. He's not behind me. He's coming uh, mid. House. Got him. A house going for going flower. One's at B. I'm going to B. Got that guy B. Right, last one was this at A. Last one was at A. I'm gonna get him off the plant, okay? They cut, they cut. They cut, rip. Oh, stairs, 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 stairs. Nice job, Carl. Good work, guys. Good work, Bums. I'm Carlson Matthew, Sismar, oh, Ken yeah. Strap, motherfucker. <laughs> if we don't hate each other, this is just like scrims. Just like scrims. Like, we he nade the like exact same scrim. goddamn spot that had no chance of killing another All right, one. Alright, back to live action. Yeah, not, 7 right, to know, 3 right now. Frag D with a nice commanding lead. And right now, we're going to have to give Buns a piss test because this guy is burning hot. <laughs> oh my goodness. Absolutely. I don't know if he's taking, uh, you know, some some riddle in there before the match. He is focused. He is ready to go. I'm gonna follow him this round. Uh, see where he's gonna do. He's exciting to watch. Uh, 
He's running straight through to the uh, B bomb site right now, headed through middle in the big arches. Uh, see somebody drop down. He's going to take some shots at improv. They're exchanging some fire there. And Buns, he's bulletproof. He's walking on water, Anger. He is just ridiculous right now. Getting the shot with the MP5. Hanging out at the B bomb site. He's got a fr uh, another frag dominant player headed all the way down to the B alley. Uh, B is pretty secure right now. Looks like there's a firefight going on at middle right now. Frag to SSR. Taking out inside Apostle. As uh, staring uh, PhD Dollar Bill right in the face. Ooh. They're together there in the middle. Uh, getting a set and nade there in Anger. And uh, what do you see going on for PhD? How are they adjusting right now? Well, PHG right now, as I'm as I'm filtering around, Postal's holding out flower pot at the A site, and uh, or excuse me, market area. I apologize for that. He's really, I'm surprised at Apostle. Now he's moving, making his way towards B. He looked a little uh, baffled there a little bit. We have SSR for Frag D uh, holding off A arches, and uh, we have A Rock at B house. So right now we're going to look at A Rock going up possibly uh, against. Looks like Apostle as he's the only member here uh, given a fake plant trying to move up the stairwells. Now he's going to meet somebody in this house. So it's going to be interesting to see who wins this 1v1 one -on -one -one battle here. And uh, again, the action just really slow off the start here. And wow, Apostle takes out A-Rock. That was the matchup I was just talking about. Now he has about 24 seconds uh, to get this plant down. And actually he's uh, putting it down right now, wants him. Yeah, he is. He's getting taken some fire there from the top of the B hill. He's going to take his AK out, do some spams there. Doesn't see anybody. Uh, Frag uh, Sphinx is actually playing pretty far back. SSR is on the side, taking him out with the AK-74. That is great clutch play there by Sphinx. Smart play. They spread him out. They split the defense. They, he didn't know where either of them were. One peaked. The other one came out, shot him in the back. And uh, Frag them is, is just flat out outplaying PHG right now, Anger. And uh, given they do have the easier side, uh, they're going to have a lot of momentum going into the halftime here. Yeah, we're going to head over to Powerhouse Gaming's event. Let's uh, listen in live right now. And then the car blows up. Alright. That was quick. Alright, let's go to work, guys. Come on. Gotta play passive. Holy crap. That was just the quickest round. Oh my goodness. 9 to 3 right now. Frag D uh, taking this into half with a big commanding lead. And right now, I'm very, very surprised the way Powerhouse is playing right now, Once I'm very stunned. This is oh, not I tell the Powerhouse. You. It's not the powerhouse we're used to seeing, but this is also not a map we're used to seeing, Anger. Um, the way the defense plays out on this, this is not entirely over. Those three rounds can go a long way on defense if PHG can get rolling early. Uh, you know, they could come back. We saw in the Pandemic Guardians match. Didn't quite go Guardians' way, but uh, things are never over uh, in this map as long as you have the defensive side with a couple rounds to spare. So uh, I'm going to take a look at PHG off the start here. Um, see what they're going to do on defense and see how aggressive uh, Frag Dominant is going to be with them. Right now they're not showing them any respect, especially my man Buns there with a 16-6 and six at halftime. You know, that's just a great play at this, uh, this kind of competition anger. So uh, PSG getting a little bit of a, a mess <laughs> at the beginning. Don't know which way they're going. We have Grimm and Improv moving towards A bomb site right now. It looks like Frag them will be sitting back pretty far at A. They're not going to fall into those nades, the vandalism there. Uh, looks like they are going to be scoping and trying to pick at the A building. Both teams doing a nice job of playing Ninja right now. Some fire being exchanged there at the A balcony. Uh, Improv's going to peek the corner a little bit. Smoke's going up. Uh, should see Frag Dominant moving in with this smoke from middle or if not from the A side. Uh, Dog Bell taking down Frag uh, Frag uh, SSR there with the AK-74. Great shot through the smoke. So <clears throat> right now things have really slowed down, Anger. Uh, they haven't used the smoke to their advantage. So right now PHG does have the upper hand on both bomb sites. Yeah, you know, we were, we were just discussing how Powerhouse, we were so amazed at how they're not doing very good right now. But then again, we got to give Frag Dominant a lot of credit the way that they're playing as the uh, defensive side there. They were just really controlling the tempo there in their favor and really just uh, putting PHG back on their heels. And as I'm looking right here now at, uh, at uh, Frag D, just showing a lot, a lot of patience. And it's very unique because you don't see a lot of teams... Uh, holding with a lot of patience, but this team is. But then again, uh, Improv with a nice double kill there. PHG really um, 
is pretty much to kind of dictate their game now, now as they're the defensive side. Maybe that's what a lot of it has to do with here, why, why Frag D's really holding off. So Grimm right now is going back and forth, shots being fired between the man and Grimm here at the A bomb site. Uh, looks like the man here at Carpool, uh, Grimm at the flower pot while Improv is in the cafe and uh, TM taking both shots from those two players there, wants him. Yeah, there he goes. He goes down. Round for PHG. And, you know, a little history, excuse me, on both of these teams, uh, Anger. Uh, PHG is probably one of the more storied uh, names out there at the moment, not under their current name. They did well at WSVG under that name. Uh, but also, the, just the players they have on their team, as far as the COD series go, they're a little bit more stir uh, storied. But uh, you take a look at this frag dominant team, Anger, and every time they face off against you know the epic team pandemic they have given them a run for their money they've scared them straight i believe it was 11 9 in the x fire tournament same kind of deal in SIBO. uh they're a good team they've proven they play well together uh, you know aside from roster changes they're a great team and they've proven that they can play with this top tier so again you're correct a lot of credit goes out to frag dominant uh they're playing a pretty slow right now as well grim's hanging out watching middle from spawn uh, Sphinx, A-Rock, and Buns all hanging out on the A-side. I see Grim hanging out there in the back A building. Uh, I don't know if he's the only one there, Anger, but uh, it appears... Oh, I'm sorry, Improv, sitting on the stairs, same positions as last round. I wouldn't be surprised to see some set nades going off here. Uh, got a couple flashes being exchanged right now. Smoke going up. Impro Improv is useless right now. He's going to have to make a move if he's going to stop this rush. Here comes Frag Dominant. They're coming in full force. Boom goes the dynamite yet again, exchanging nade kills. Frag Dominant comes in with four guys over the wall, Anger. They're headed into A. The bomb goes down, and PHG is running scared. They don't know what just hit him, Anger. Yeah, it, you, I mean, everything was so quiet. You can hear a pin drop, and out of nowhere, a smoke just popped off couple nades and then Frag D just got in there and put the bomb down and just doing a nice job Grim is going up against four Frag D members so it's going to be 1v4 plus he has a bomb to, to uh, defuse here and plus if that's not enough he has 30 seconds to do it here wow. this is going to be a tough task uh, for Grim as he gets taken out by Buns <laughs> 10 to 4 in the favor of Frag D and that was a very very unique strat there I haven't seen that uh, actually really delaying like that and just coming in very very strong but then again I don't play this game a total total uh, enough <laughs> here like I should be but I suck like I always tell you guys I, I'm horrible at this game. Well, I, I have expected bagpipes and Braveheart cries to go out on that one anger Fractum just came in for it <laughs> outshot him there looks like they're gonna have the same kind of deal going here get an early nade kill Apostle going down he's not doing much anyway sorry buddy uh, Sphinx taking out Improv and uh, all kinds of nades being exchanged right now. They're hanging out in the car lot again. Fragdom looks like they're massing up again for another huge attack here, Anger. Uh, looks like Grimm's going to be playing down at the bottom of the stairs. He's going to take out Buns. So lead kill is down for uh, Frag Dominant right now. They still have three guys in the A bomb site. And it looks like PHG is going to have to move from mid. Grimm going down Dollar Bill. Exchanging kills with him. Insight coming up big for his team. We're now in a 2 on 2 situation. Uh, fake plant going down for Frag Dominant. Uh, the other frag dominant player, uh, the man, is playing back in the parlor, uh, parking lot area. He's taking some fire from inside. They're going to exchange some blows. A-Rock taking down Dollar Bill, just avoiding that barrel. I wouldn't be surprised to see the move be here, Anger. Uh, looks like Insight's going to take down A-Rock one-on-one situation. Clutch sauce time. Uh, the man hanging out in the middle. And looks like they're just going to sit right across from each other. They're going to move closer and closer. Here it comes. Insight taking Ooh. down the man. That's the round uh, match. I'm sorry, round for PHG. That's just great play. It's not over yet, Anger. Yeah, you gotta calm down. The match ain't over yet. You're ready to bust a nut. Jeez, Wanson. This is a good match, man. <laughs> oh, I know, definitely. Well, you know, Frag Dominant is 2-0, and, oh, and they took out End Effect last week, 14-10, to 10, while Powerhouse is about also a 2-0. Oh. Uh, they took out Firefighters 16-8. to 8. So uh, both those teams... Both teams coming in at 2 0, so no surprising here that these two teams are very evenly matched. But then again, right now, as Frag D really has the advantage here uh, early in these rounds. So uh, right now, we have Improv holding off at the uh, A site, and uh, Speaks just uh, at the carpool area trying to get some shots into Insight. Uh, again, we have right now, we have Apostle down along with Dollar Bill. So right now, we have Grim, Insight, and Improv for Powerhouse going up again against all five members of Frag D. And Frag right now, Frag Dominant is really showing how to stay alive in a game because I've seen it numerous times where they at least have four if not all five of their members alive and kicking even when they get the bomb down. It's very very impressive to see that. 
Oh, absolutely. They're doing a great job avoiding those nays, taking their picks early, and then just having that odds-on advantage when it comes down to it. They do it again. Uh, SSR, the man, Buns, still left alive for Frag Dominant. All the PH members have been down. That was another quick round there. Uh, Anger, let's take a look at uh, uh, Frag, Frag Dominant right now, see what they're going to do here. Uh, see if they're more aggressive towards PHG right now. It'll be real interesting to see. Uh, if they come with that huge, massive A rush yet again, looks like they're all sitting back at spawn again, waiting out those nades, playing smart, uh, real relaxed, they're not worried about anything right now. Uh, got some smoke going up at the A bomb site. Buns is going to push forward a little bit, maybe getting a little greedy here, uh, moving towards the A arches, and I'm going to cycle through here. Looks like we have, uh, <coughs> excuse me, uh, PH. G Grimm and Improv playing back. They're playing scared, Anger. They're way too far back in the A-bomb site to do any good against any sort of rush right now. So if uh, Frag Dominant can take uh, advantage of this, they will move through, but it looks like they have passed on. Uh, they're moving back through spawn. Dollar Bill is coming through. They're, he's going to try to flank through Champagne Alley. And he's headed back through, uh, coming back through spawn. He's going to take a sprint through. An Apostle coming up big for his team. PHG gets three kills in a row. Five on one situation here. A bun still alive. Apostle coming up big. He must have heard us talking. He's picking his game up, Anger. Well, he's trying to, he's trying to, and he's doing a nice job thus far. So 11 to 6 right now in the favor of Frag D. So let's head on over to Frag Dominus War Room. Let's go there now. Wait till we see. I'll just say after I'm waiting on something. Careful. Scope in the back. Wall down. Wall nice. down. I'm doing There's my smoke now. It's the door. I'm doing my smoke now. Scope in the back side. It's gonna be flower. Just plant it. Faked it. I faked it. In the corner. Wow, he's up on foul power. Plank. Plank one. Win this. Cut. In cut, in cut. Good job. One plank. Mid. In market. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait for a push somewhere. Check the flower corner. Top A. Actually, A building. Fake. Flake! How does he not flank? We can't let no. flower kill. Alright, back like to that. live action now. 11 oh, to 7 now in the favor of Frag D. And uh, Powerhouse trying to make a small comeback here, uh, Wansom. Yeah, I agree. This is not over yet. They uh, did some great clutch play there. Apostle has really picked up his end of the stick here. He's getting trade kills. Going down early, but he's still working out. Uh, PHG having an interesting strat here. They're only going to send one guy to A this round. Uh, they're sending B heavy, rushing mid. Got some smoke going there. Apostle and Improv rushing mid. They're hanging out on top of the market right now. Haven't seen anybody do this. Looks like they may have planned right. Fragdom is holding back. They've got SSR and uh, Buns, I'm sorry, moving into the B room. Uh, this could be a good call by PHG here, Anger. Yeah, right now we have, again, nobody has died. Well, Buns is down by the uh, scope of Grim. Uh, so nice shot there as Spinks right now for Frag Dominus is moving into carpool area and uh, possibly trying to get something going here for uh, Frag D. We have Grim just peeking on top of the car here. Oh, trying to get that scope. Uh, doesn't quite get it on Spinks, but nice shot nonetheless. They're trying to get him there. And Spinks is taking out oh. Grim. They're nice nade toss. So right now as I'm heading on over, most of Frag D's uh, uh, players have over here a B, uh, B building here, uh, moving into B uh, spirals. And and uh, they're possibly trying to get this bomb down. They got about uh, a little bit over 50 seconds here. As the oh, the man just got raped there by insights. M4 Apostle 
Potato oh. A-Rock. So teams are just firing back and forth there. And PHG is making a comeback here, 11 to 8. I don't want to jinx it, but uh, they're, they're looking nice thus far. So we're going to head on over to their vent. Let's uh, go war room coverage over at Powerhouse. Let's see. I think I seen one A. I flashed up there, Sean. Grenade. One A. Everyone wait. They're waiting for us to make a mistake. Smoke. Busty rotate. Yeah, I got pay. Start rotating. Yeah, Busty rotate. Yeah. I got pay. Uh, They're definitely going A. One ledge. One ledge. Nading ledge. That's the plan. I needed ledge. All right, Sean. No, I'm strings. with you. And I have a uh, flash. 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 Watch out! He needs to go left, left, left. In there. Bushes. Ah, oh, ledge. Watch the car behind you, bro. Steps. Nice bro. Nice, nice try. try, guys. Let's hold them. All right, back to live action here. 12 to 8 right now, and Frag D getting that round and pretty much uh, halting PHG's chances there. At least, uh, at least for one more round there, wants him. Oh, absolutely. PHG. Uh, I think they, pr they they sort of sensed that Fragden was going to go for another one of those big. Uh, Four-man A rushes there. They tried to counteract it by pushing a couple guys flanked, uh, but Frag Dominant was able to catch on to those guys. They only traded one kill with them, so looks like we have the same kind of situation here. Fragdom's going to try to end it the way they started it. All-out rush at A. Looks like they got all four members. One watching flank. Buns, uh, A Rock, Sphinx, all moving in there with SSR. They're coming to the A bomb site, and I hope PHG does not have only Grim over here again. Looks like Improv is helping out. So we got a scope and Grim Improv hanging out there in the corner of the stairs. Here comes the smoke. The signature here from Frag Dominant. Here they come. Coming down the stairs. They split left. They split right. Dollar Bill getting the pineapple there on SSR. Uh, the man splitting it with Dollar Bill there. Improv taking out Sphinx. We're trading kills back and forward here. Uh, PHG still has the advantage. Frag Dominant is down on the bomb site. However, they're hanging out by the well. Looks like they're going to deploy some smoke and go for a plant here, Andrew. Ooh, Improv right now. Just taking out A-Rock and Buns. Nice shot there. The man taking out inside. Improv with a triple kill there, triple, triple that puppy whoa, whoa. up right now, and wow, nice job. PHG still hanging on by a thread here, 12 to 9 uh, as we head into the next round. Very, very entertaining here uh, toward the latter part of these uh, of this match here, uh, Wansom. <laughs> well, absolutely, he kind of stepped in and said, allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is O. And so Frag Dominant is going to come through A again. They got four guys coming again. They're going to try and finish it the same way. Did not work last round. PHG to get the, able to get those uh, trade kills there. Uh, Grim is hanging back down there with the scope. Looks like uh, PHG Apostle Improv hanging out in the middle. They might try a push here when Frag Dominant tries to push through the middle. Uh, Frag Dominant again. Anger just playing really disciplined right now. They're not making stupid peaks. They're waiting for the time to go down and put PHG into a sort of uh, uh, hustle there. Yeah, right now all five members for both teams alive here, and it's going to be interesting. Now, what's inter what I think is interesting that Frag D must see something in uh, PHG's defense here to keep going A. It's you know they're they're really pushing this and pushing it very well. They were successful in the early rounds here, so I guess they're just going to go right back to it because they, their B rushes weren't as uh, successful as these A's and right now we have a rock and the man right now the man looks like he's trying to oh he gets a fake uh, plant there uh, just to see where PHG's at and as I'm looking around we have Apostle in the prone position near the flower pot so he's in the vicinity of the, of the a bomb site so he could be uh, possibly someone to watch for but uh, Frag D does not see him 
him. And right now we have Insight really doing a flank around here in the carpool area. And uh, the man taking out Dollar Bill and Speaks taking out Insight there. A Apostle taking out A-Rock. So back and forth action. Apostle, the only man left alive for PHG. And the man and Spinks, uh, the two members for... Uh, Frag D right now wants him as we might see a possible firefight. TM and a possible oh. puzzle taking him out. Wow. So right now, this one game one speaks and a possible. Ten seconds to get something going here. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, he does. Apostle it. taking out Speaks and cleans that up. Oh, Apostle is alive, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the game, Apostle, as he's doing some damage there. 12 to 10 right now in the favor of Frag D. Oh, this is just a great match, Anger. Do I smell another another uh, want some Anger overtime match here? Could be fun. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to follow PHG, see what they're going to do to try to keep their hustle on here. They're going to have the same defense they've been working with the last couple rounds. Uh, so far, Frag Domina has been able to, to defeat them these last few rounds, so why change it? It's working. Uh, Smoke going up again. Frag Domina playing real reserved. You know, if... Uh, if Improv could get a nade back there, he could really mess things up royally for Frag Dominant right now. Let's see what he's going to do. He's smoked out. He's going to get set naded himself. Gets away. Uh, Grim coming up on top of the yellow car back there. Frag Dominant is down on the bomb. The bomb goes down. SSR has the bomb down. Moves away. Frag Dominant has uh, all members alive. Improv has gone down. It's a five on four situation. We have 50 seconds Ooh. left on the clock. Dollar Bill's going to get a set nade. That's the third, fourth time I've seen him do that, Anger. Yeah, right now, Apostle coming in, just wipes out SSR there with a nice headshot. He's got insight at the bomb site here. Uh, Buns, A-Rock are the only two members for Frag D. Grim taking out uh, the man inside, taking out Bun. A-Rock is by himself. He gets jumps over the cross. He gets taken out by an insight with an M4. And all that, Apostle was diffusing it. Great job, Here PHG. Can they do this? Can they do this, Here Monson? Can they go. take it an OT? You know what? I'm pulling for him. This is the great, greatest matchup I've had a you know a pleasure to be a part of in my short casting career. This is really exciting. I hope to see PHG get this off so we can keep casting uh, these two great and, teams and right to, here. Yeah, Monson, let's go right now to Frag D's uh, war room. I'm curious to hear what they're saying. Roger that. I'm going to smoke some flying car. Alright, I'm watching them. Back in the A building. I'm planting left side, our side. I got the bomb there. Um, flower. 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 Need help. you do that? That's right. We should have had like those last three. Well, it's not my fucking fault a faggot gets team mated and then fucking Rob dies right off Guys, the bomb. Guys, relax! Alright, back to live Man, action. Holy off. shit. I want my knees. I am praying to PHG here. <laughs> wow. What a comeback. Grim and Apostle. Oh my god, these two have just brought Powerhouse back and we are going to OT. I love this, Wansom. I love it. Here we go, baby. Here we go. You, you know what? I know Frag D right now is probably kicking themselves in the ass. They had a five round commanding lead and just to let PHG in the door like that, momentum is totally on Powerhouse's side right now. Wow. Oh, they totally switched poles there. I mean, you gotta. We, I think we should take a look here at Powerhouse Gaming's Vin here this first round and when we get started. But I mean, PHG just has to be walking on water right now. They fought back. Great teamwork. Apostle picked it up, helped his team out. You know, he's in second place on his team uh, at the end of the half there. So, you know, great work by PHG. They did some great work. Frag Dominant is ready to up. They said, let's get this on. Uh, they want to show they're the better team here. So, um, Anger, who, who are you going to pick here in this overtime? What's your what's your poison? Well, right now PHG is on a total high. Right now they have the moment, all the momentum in their favor, and uh, you know I'm going to go with them on that just because they have the momentum right now. They have really put Frag D on their heels because earlier in those rounds, Frag D was just totally, totally controlling this map. And, and when they went on the offensive side, that all just shut down. Uh, they, they had a couple successful uh, A pushes, 
uh, getting the bomb down and such, but I mean PHG just really changed things up there and really put the clamps on Frag D to get him back in this game and now we're into overtime. Who are you picking here, buddy? You know what? I'm going to have to go against you here, man. I like the PHG guys, one of my favorite teams out there. They're, uh, they're a group of uh, professional guys out there, you know, and they, they act real calm, calm, cool, and collect around everybody. But let's remember how Frag Dominant acted on this map in the beginning. They dominated there on defense. Um, you know, PHG did well on defense as well, but Frag Dominant had a big lead there going into uh, the defensive side. So I'm going to take Frag Dominant and say that they're going to win this by one round here, of course. So let's take a look at what Frag Dominant's going to do here, Anger. They're going to do a 3-2 split. Uh, coming into A pretty heavily here. Looks like PHG is going to try a sort of a slow push, what they had been doing before. Uh, they got two guys headed into A right now, smoking out. Got a scope in the back. He's trying to get a pick. Grimm's going to have to come up big for his team here to get into A. Um, got Insight, Improv, Dollar Bill, Grimm, all moving into the A site right now. Smoke's going to go down. They're taking a playbook or a page out of the playbook from Frag Domina here, Anger. They're going to do the same thing. Rush in, shove it in their face, say thanks for the strat. Looks like we got SSR hanging out by the well. I don't know if anybody sees them. Dollar Bill's going to come up behind him, take him out with the AK-74. A PHG coming up big here. Two members of Frag Dominant left. Uh, you know, four members left for PHG. They're going to get a plant down. I might be eating my words here, Anger, but the plant, the plant is not going to go down. Buns comes up big. It trades a kill here. One member left for Fragman. I'm going to try and cycle through, find him. He's hanging out in the parking garage. So PHG is... Oh! Grim's going to get the scope shot on him. I spoke too soon. PHG comes out big and firing on offense, Anger. Right now, we're going to head into War Room because Overtime War Room is going to be the best. A lot of people are probably screaming their heads off. Uh, just balls just probably tighter than a nut let's uh, go into PHG's war room right now alright yeah hold on for these nades he's gonna push up ledge basically smoke it I hit him he's so lit up I'm gonna need ledge he just climbed over he's, yeah, he's pushing stairs. pushing he pushed flank oh god but yeah, I mean, might be soda cans. Is he? Might. Hold on, man. Hold on, man. There's only one here. Oh, he's in my house. My house. Reload. What the fuck? Alright guys, last round, let's go. He was in oh my god, he was in there. <laughs> Back to live action and Frag D uh, gets that round there, so one to one and you know what, let's just go straight to another war room. Let's go to Frag Dominance right now, Eric. Um, no, you don't have to. If you want to. Oh, they're already on their catwalk. Fuck. They're already, they, yeah, they're already mid. The rock. Smoke on A. Oh, Misstep, misstep. One on the. One on the bomb, one on the stairs in front of you. Another on the bomb. Hey, One's on B. Stay alive. I'm in a bad spot, I'm trying to. He might go to our spawn, be careful. One's in the midst that. Stay live, Buns. Back A building, going flower.
got work to Let's do. Go. Let's go. Three zero. We can do it. All right, we back to live three action, and PHG gets that round right there. So two to one right now. Powerhouse uh, gets that. So we're going to be switching sides here, and uh, we're going to rotate this out. Eric, very entertaining. Very, very entertaining. And I can't hear the war rooms right now, but I can just only imagine what they are sounding like. I bet there's there's some tense voices going on. Uh, you know, they're they're trying to adjust to each other real fast. Probably a lot more talking going on than usual. Maybe a good or bad thing for both teams. Uh, both teams want to come up big here, Anger. So, uh, you know, <clears throat> I'm a little stunned there how things turned out in that first half. But again, you know, Frank Don. Uh, does have that hurry up and rush strategy, uh, you know, well, more of a hurry up and wait than rush strategy there on uh, the offensive side of the map. So, you, you know, I think they, I could really see them switching things up on PHG here and actually going be the first round. They have not done that, you know, in, in a very long time. So, could see something new here from Frank Dominant Anger. Yeah, no doubt. And in case you're just wondering, the B first going up against Final D will be on another stream, and my man Lamek and Shogun will be taking that. Uh, that will be at 10.30 Eastern, so that should be coming up really quick there, in case you guys want to watch that. But uh, if you guys want to hang in here, watch a nail biter, just stay tuned right here, as Powerhouse and Frag D are definitely giving it to you. And uh, what are you seeing so far, Wansom? Oh, you know, just like I thought what would happen, Frag Dominant is moving pretty, you know, solidly into the A-bomb site. I uh, got some flashes going out. Sphinx has already moved into the uh, A balcony there. Grim's going to take a shot. Going to miss. Going to get a tag. Uh, frustrating him. Apostle is going to come up big again. Headshot there. Yet again. Apostle's doing it big. Going to get a pineapple on him, though. Apostle's down. Uh, did trade two kills there. Bomb is down for Frag Dominant. They're going to run. Scurry away. They're back into the car lot here, but Grim says, hey, and puts a scope in his face. So Frag Dominant's going to go down two on four here, Anger. What do you see? Well, again, inside in the cafe right now, getting some shots. It looks like over at the carpool area, which uh, the man is in. Dollar Bill takes him out as Dollar Bill is flanking around. He's going up against SSR there. Oh, SSR takes out Dollar Bill. So right now we have SSR all by himself here as he's in the carpool area. And he's going to be going up against Improv Insight, trying to get into the scene of the crime along with Grim. And that is it. Three to one right now in the favor of powerhouse gaming so all they need right now is just a few more rounds or actually one more round here so they're in a three to one, one advantage more. that is no, absolutely it. this is the tie round it's not over yet ladies and gentlemen we could see a second overtime we could see an immediate win here for frag i'm sorry for phg so uh Let's take a look here at what PHG is doing. Um, Frag Dominant playing really reserved here. They don't want to make any mistakes. Uh, PHG sticking with that same solid defense. It's failed them. It's worked for them. And right now, they're just playing with a lot of hard anger. Yeah, right now, let's head on over to Frag D's uh, van. I'm very curious to hear what they're saying now, especially when we're getting to the uh, tighter rounds here. Let's go to Frag D's war room. Grab her back in their spawn. I'm pushing their side of mid, hold on. Can we get a smoke and a B bomb site somewhere? I will. I hear him moving laundry. Flower. Laundry, Zach. Laundry. They're playing 2A. Stay alive, don't get picked by behind that guy. A, behind A, behind A, Let's help him. Put 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 pressure on that guy. Time, time. I'm playing A. I'm playing A. Just don't die. Never mind. He's over here. He's over here. Plant, plant, plant. All right, back to live action. Wow! Congratulations. Go out to. Powerhouse Gaming with a nice, nice comeback and want some 
right now, Frag D's got to be kicking themselves in the ass. They let this one slip through their fingers here. A, a more than a certain win here, and they just let Powerhouse right back in the door. Oh boy, did they ever. I mean, you know, uh, my heart goes out to Frag Dominant right there. I thought they would pull through with that uh, offensive strategy they have, but PHG just flat out outplayed them. Cannot speak enough for PHG. Great game by both teams. Uh, you know, PHG just took it and ran with it there. They got a roll and they did not let up. A lot of pride shown there from their veteran players. You know, Apostle picking it up big time for them. So, uh, you know, I'd love to get one of those guys in there, in here, and talk to them. I mean, that's a great match, Anger. Yeah, I'm gonna try to get Apostle in here right now. I, I know he has the uh, rev info, so hopefully he still has it here, so we can get right. him in. I got a couple but of shout outs if uh, yeah. if we're if we're not too busy. Yeah, I got uh, first. Off, I want to, you know, give a big shout out to Leap Tube, our new media uh, partnership. Uh, you know, my heart goes out to Solly. A triple sec. You're keeping it sexy in ways that most men can't. I'll put it that way. You guys want to head over to www.leaptube.com. Uh, you'll see the banner right there below the cast page. Click on that. Give them some love. A lot of cool frag videos over there. It's going to be a really interesting website. They're growing huge, and we're glad to be partnered with them. I uh, got some more shout-outs here. I got a shout-out from uh, an icy hot ang. And he said, if anger's the hotness, then one sums the ice. You guys keep it cool. I uh, like what you guys are doing. Good, good shout-cast. Great game to both teams. I got a shout out here from, uh, looks like, uh, Thought Tech Joey. Uh, Joey says, pound Thought Tech, ThoughtTech.com. Thank you, Erev, for your support, and I love Fraglin. You know, my, my heart goes out to you, buddy. They didn't pull it through, but uh, both teams played very, very well today. Uh, Anger, you got any shout outs you want to run through before we get a player in here for that post interview? Yeah, yeah, we're going to get Apostle in here for an interview, but I have a, I have a lot of shout-outs. But first, I want to get this one out. This one's a special one to me because I haven't seen this stud in a while. My man Strider he used to cast over BF, uh, Battlefield 2 right. and Battlefield 2142. And Strider has a shout-out to Anger. Still a sexy bitch, and uh, thank you, Strider. Strider for that. Also, he has a, a random shout out to Casio. You're still a scrub. Jerunk, you're a you're a hero. And Michael D, you're a machine. That's from my man Strider. I hope you come back soon. I know he's doing big things in his personal life with a uh, business and everything. So hopefully he can come back and do a a special cast with me and some of the other guys. So uh, also he'll he will be there at the Gigafrag Land in Bayside, California. And uh, you know we'll. I'll make sure I'll see him there, and that will be March 15th. Uh, if you have any more shouts real quick, I'm going to give Apostle the vent info. It looks like he lost it like a, a douche, so uh, I'll give that to him right now <laughs> while you get those uh, shout-outs right now. All right, not a problem. Let me look through them. I have a shout-out here from, uh, looks like STL. A uh, shout-out to Anger, the hostess with the most. Uh, he is the man. He is the voice of COD4. I want to remind everybody, I'm just the hostess that likes hostess products, all right? You know, you, you give me a, give me a couple of those snack cakes, I'm good to go. Uh, <laughs> look through here. I want to remind everybody, Erev is going live in Europe, ladies and gentlemen. We had our Eurocasters on here earlier. Uh, they did a North American cast for us. They're doing it big. Uh, you know, they're jolly blokes, as they would say. They're good guys. They do great casts. So um, stay tuned for some European coverage. Uh, I'd also like to remind everybody yet again, we're going to Nerdland, baby. We'll be there. We'll be broadcasting live. Uh, you know, all the coverage you guys could possibly want. Uh, you know, we're going to get you those big matches. We'll keep you updated on score. And uh, we'll also have live video from the Nerve Land Center there. It looks like a great place. So I want to remind everybody to tune in on, uh, what is it, March the 8th, I believe. Uh, shout out to Chimpe for getting that all set up for us. Uh, next time, Chimp, uh, go ahead and post those brackets on our site, though, buddy. I'm out of shout outs. Looks like Apostle is in the channel, Anger. Let's take it away. Yeah, Apostle, welcome in. I just want to, I mean, you beasted it up towards the end there. I want to give you mad props. Uh, first of all, congratulations on an epic, epic match, man. How do, you, how, does you, how do you feel and your team coming up with this big win? Oh, we feel great, man. My, my heart's pounding still, actually. Uh, although I heard some things that you guys were talking uh, shit about me doing bad in the beginning. Yep, that is right, and I was very surprised you were stinking it up, Apostle. It wasn't the type of Apostle that I'm used to seeing, but you really nutted up there and did a nice job towards the end. What were your thoughts going in at the beginning, uh, going up against Frag D there? I mean, how were you guys feeling? Because they were dominating that uh, beginning to half uh, half of the match there. 
Well, I don't know, we just took it like every other time. Just gotta step it up. We're, we use the uh, excuse that well, we're on offense, right? So, we're, we're really good on defensive on that map, so we just used that to our advantage and uh, had some great clutches. Now, I didn't get a chance to hear the war room, but let me ask you this. I mean, who who in that channel really got you guys together to really uh, make you make you feel real good as you got into those later rounds to get you into the overtime period? Who was the one that stepped it up on the team? Who was the team leader? No, oh, it's Rob. Rob all the way, man. He would uh, come us all the way down. We were uh, way up there in the beginning, and he just brought us down to play on our level. All right. Well, in overtime, and you know, I was making a prediction that you guys would win that in overtime because, again, you guys had the momentum there uh, in those later rounds, and you took that right into overtime. Did you guys feel the same way? Uh, sorry about that. I'm going to have to actually repeat. Insight just mentioned me to mention that uh, his 1v2 sparked up the clutch, uh, or sparked up the uh, comeback. <laughs> No, I was stating that, you know, in overtime, uh, when you guys were going into overtime, you guys uh, had the momentum on your side, and I predicted you guys to win that overtime because of that one fact, the momentum. Did you guys feel that, too, knowing that you guys had the momentum, you guys knew that going into that overtime? <laughs> oh, yeah, we were just, that's what our thing was. We're like, we've won just so many rounds, we probably killed their, killed their whole entire attitude. Like, we had a bunch of clutches at the end. They had to be so pissed in vent. I can't wait to hear the war room, to be honest. How did <laughs> yeah, you guys... We, uh... How did you guys feel you adjusted? I mean, what was your, your adjustment there to uh, sort of that all-out delayed rush there coming from Frag Dominant? Uh, they laid back really quiet, real still, and then just sort of ran into the A-bomb site there all at once. So, uh, you know, how did you guys adjust to that? You guys made some changes. What was running through your guys' head there? Well, we just decided that uh, if they want to play the slow game, we can play it too. So we just waited, kept hitting, and as soon as they go to, you know, fake that bomb, we'd peek and get the few picks we needed. We also had a couple set nades in there and uh, helped us to the victory. All right, our last question here. You know, Buns at the beginning was just like a wild man on the loose, just really doing, causing a lot of havoc to your team. And I noticed towards the middle to the end, you guys really controlled him. Was that a priority on your guys' list to, to put uh, a leash on that guy? To be honest, we uh, never really think about one player. We just uh, adjust ourselves. We don't even think about it. All right. Well, Apostle, again, great game there. And everybody that was watching the cast was just blowing up IRC. They were loving it. Nice comeback. Any uh, last-minute shout-outs that you have to the people out there in the cyber world? Any uh, sponsorships or anything of that matter? Um, just a shout-out to all our sponsors. New one, it's Brand Zone, and uh, shout-out to my team. Great comeback. All right. We appreciate that, Apostle. Uh, want some right now? I have a ton of shout outs. I'm going to try to get these uh, across in our next cast here. Uh, we're going to head on over to the uh, B first and final D match, and I'll get those shout outs across. So, people, please be patient here. I will get, well, let me, you know what? Let me get a couple out real quick before we close this off. Um, shout out here from Joey from. Uh, from Hot, Hot Tech here, uh, just to head on over to Pound Hot Tech, uh, www.hottech, or thehawktech.com. Uh, thank you, Ira, for your support, and uh, also thank you for your support too, uh, Hawk. And uh, we have one from uh, Seal here. Shout out to Frag D for being the shit. Uh, that's uh, from Seal there, and we also have one from uh, looks like Gnome. Uh, tell me, say Sphinx, uh, not Sphinx. I can't no, no I try dude but it's my it's my accent dude I'm sorry dude so I can't please you on that one but nevertheless uh, we're gonna put this cast to rest here Eric and we're gonna head on over to the next cast now you can check that out right now on the other stream on the eref site I believe it's one or two I'm not really sure but it is B first going up against final D so we're gonna take that over uh, from my man Shogun so uh, stay tuned for that and until next time bon voyage